In with breaking news, firefighters battled a large fire at a salvage yard in Grand Prairie yes. this evening. Just look at this. I mean, the fire looks to have destroyed dozens of cars. We want to go ahead and get straight to our Ali Spillier, who is live with more on this. Ali, what do we know so far? Brittany and Brian, we got word from Grand Prairie Fire just in the last 20 minutes or so that this fire is now under control. But you can see the glow of the flames and even some of that smoke behind me of what is still left in this situation. Now, we are some distance from this fire. Police have been blocking the roads in this area. One officer told us that was to make sure that the fire hydrants around the salvage yard remained available and easy to access for the firefighters should they need them. But you can really see the scale of what happened earlier here today when you look at what our chopper video caught from the sky. Grand Prairie Fire tells us this all started with multiple compacted automobiles that caught fire that led to the thick, dark smoke plume that we saw here in the sky for hours and you can see video of that from the ground which stopped some traffic as people were trying to figure out what was going on and it also forced some people to reroute. Officials tell us there have been no injuries and no need for evacuations. That's likely because this area is mostly commercial. This salvage yard is one of two on this street. We're in a flea market lot right now. There are other automobile based businesses. There is a mobile home park nearby, but it seems pretty sheltered from the situation they've had here today. And again, Grand Prairie Fire tells us that this is now under control, but they have said that they will remain on scene here throughout the night, making sure that all of those hot spots and, and the flames you can see here are taken care of. And I can tell you we're also hearing a lot of popping right now. Um, obviously, we know it's vehicles burning in a salvage yard, so it does sound like something like that is kind of fanning the situation here. Brian, Brittany. Thankfully, once again, under control tonight. Some good news there. Allie Spilliers, thank you.